Hey guys, this is Patrick here. What I wanted to show you today is a piece of software called DMUX. Essentially it's an AI model which will isolate um, the instrument tracks from any piece of music you have. So first off, you'll start on this GitHub page. I'll link it in the description. Um, so this is releases for Windows and Mac. So you go to the releases page, you scroll down, so you'll download the respective either Windows or Mac version. Uh, CPU release obviously just uses your CPU. Uh, the CUDA release is if you have an NVIDIA GPU, and that would be faster for you. Um, if you're in doubt, I'd say just use the CPU release. And then that will download a 7-zip file, which you'll extract. Um, I've already done that just to save time. And you'll go to the DMUX GUI executable. You'll open that up, um, and it'll open a thing like this. Um, just go load model. And this just takes a little while to load. And then from there, all you have to do go is browse file to separate, and you'll go to a piece of music you want to separate. Um, I've already done a couple here, you can see, um, this is Slayer, so let's say I click the Antichrist, duh, 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 it starts extracting. Now this does take a while, so I've just pre-done it, just to save time. So once it's done, it'll create a separate file, a separate folder rather, in the music track directory. So it's done this for the Antichrist. So it's got bass, drums, vocals, and other. Obviously, in this case, other will be the guitar tracks. So if I, say, play the bass. Yeah, you get the idea. Drums. Other, which will be guitar. And vocals. Now, it's obviously, it's AI model based off the music tracks. It's not always going to be perfect isolation. Um, you'll be bleeding from other instrument tracks and from from what I found, especially with metal, if the bass is kind of blended in with the guitar tracks very well, um, there's not good separation, it'll often struggle to separate the bass out. Um, I imagine if you try to do that on the Injustice for All album, for example, it'd probably struggle a bit to find the bass tracks. But yeah, it's a very cool piece of software and very useful, so I just wanted to do a quick video on it. Um, yeah, so I hope you enjoy and I hope you find use in it.